music. Shut up. You know what? Seven years ago, I walked into Hughes Academy. And sorry, do you want me to come out there? Do you guys want to do a promo? Okay, cool. Say something smart. AJ sucks. Oh, good one. Anybody else want to say something smart? As I was saying, I walked in, I changed the place for the better, but I was given an opportunity, I was given an opportunity to referee and eventually to wrestle, I was given that opportunity by my opponent tonight, the standard hero, Graham Hughes. So for all of you, you can boo me, you can cheer me, you can do whatever you want. This is a match about respect, because I respect this man. And I'm going to have a good, clean, wrestling match with him, test my skills, and win. Thank you, Jimmy. You've been great. We have seen a lot of people in this uh, in this ring tonight who you could call technical masterminds or technical wizards, but none as much as this man right here, Graham Hughes, a veteran of the UK wrestling scene, a veteran of the New Zealand wrestling scene. Ring Extremely technically gifted is Graham Hughes. He's a absolute general in the ring, is this man. And not only uh, technically gifted, extremely good uh, playing, playing the referee, playing dirty tactics, pushing the limits of uh, what the referee will allow in a match right to its limit. And if there's anyone that's going to be teaching AJ Murto a lesson, it's uh, going to be Graham Hughes. And I tell you what, I hope, uh, I hope the lesson from Graham Hughes is taught to AJ Murto, and I hope it's taught well. Looking like we're starting off with uh, trading wrist locks at, uh, in the early portions of the match. If there's anyone that uh, you don't want to be trading wrist locks and uh, don't want to be trading wrist locks and uh, holds with, I tell you what, it's Graham Hughes. And Graham Hughes uh, just wrestling circles around AJ Myrtle going from a wrist lock to a headlock straight to a hammerlock. Graham there. Uh, uncharacteristically breaking the hold uh, before the referee had even started counting. Maybe Graham's, uh, yeah. maybe Graham's feeling a little bit, uh, a little bit more respectful in this match than he normally would be. And I tell you what, AJ, bit of a show of respect there, shaking Graham Hughes' hand. I tell you what, if I was Graham Hughes, I wouldn't be shaking AJ Myrtle's hand. I'm surprised AJ didn't uh, pull any dirty trucks at that point. And maybe, maybe that was the expectation, you know. As I said, AJ Murta was no stranger to dirty tactics and dirty, dirty cheap shots. And maybe if you expect him to pull a cheap trick and he doesn't do it, maybe that gets in your head a little bit more than pulling the trick that you expect. AJ now looking uh, apprehensive, almost apprehensive with their... Uh, trading holds up against there with uh, Graham Hughes and rightfully so Graham Hughes knows his way around technical ring knows his way around technical wrestling AJ there thinking he had uh, Graham Hughes with a bit of a modified arm drag a modified arm bar I should say Graham Hughes with a very creative counter getting out of that hold. again AJ working his way to his feet Graham Hughes not allowing him to stay on his feet. 
locking that armbar in really deep. And I talked Graham Hughes just earlier, breaking the hold before the referee had even gotten to the count, but uh, maybe Graham was feeling sort of uh, sending a message to AJ Murtal with that one, just wrenching that arm just a couple of seconds longer than he needed to. Graham Hughes looking for a test of strength here with AJ Murtal. AJ. I don't know if he was looking for advice from the crowd before locking in that. And straight away, Graham Hughes wrestling circles around AJ. So as much as, as, much as oh, a kick to the spine from Graham Hughes, as much as AJ is a relative newcomer to the wrestling scene, you know, he's only been proper wrestling for maybe a year and a half. The man was a referee. The man was around the wrestling scene for almost 10 years. So while he hasn't necessarily been in the ring fighting, he has been watching all of his opponents. He's been watching other competitors, learning. This, it's the best tape study a man could ever get, is being right there in the action, seeing it as it happens, being up close and learning from it. AJ Murtor. The bigger man getting slams there from Graham Hughes. Not a big slam, just a disrespectful hoist and drop. But I tell you what, wrestling moves don't need to be showy to be effective. Dropping a man onto the mat is still going to uh, do damage to the man's back. And it looks like that's what Graham Hughes is uh, looking to target. Again with that kick to the back. Oh, and a big suplex onto AJ Murtor. AJ is looking stunned. And AJ doesn't look like he's barely gotten out of the blocks at this point. He is. I mean, he said he was going to wrestle a clean match, and maybe he was telling the truth. Oh, Graham Hughes going for the leg drop that maybe could have ended AJ Murtor, but AJ rolling straight out of the way. And I think AJ was going for his diamond cutter, a move that has won him several matches but Graham Hughes clearly has done his homework clearly he's done his homework and wrestled uh, managed to wrestle out of that one I don't know what uh, if AJ Myrtle now is looking to recover in the corner Graham Hughes Graham Hughes oh I don't think so I couldn't quite see them but I saw AJ poke the eye, but did AJ just... Did AJ just low blow Graham Hughes? Your winner of the match, AJ Murtaugh! I don't know, I, I couldn't quite see from this angle, and clearly the referee couldn't see it, but I think AJ just low blowed Graham Hughes in what could have been the upset of the night there. AJ Murtaugh beating a almost 20 year, maybe more, veteran there for Graham Hughes, and AJ... He's clearly got something planned with that top turnbuckle. Ripping apart that top turnbuckle now is AJ Murtor. Looks like he has got dastardly plans now for Graham Hughes. And oh my god, no! Ramming Graham Hughes head straight into that top metal top turnbuckle. And that's not only solid metal and very heavy solid metal, but there's a there's a hook on the top of that turnbuckle facing upwards. That hook straight into the the face, the, the eye maybe, of Graham Hughes. And Graham is clutching his, his face. And I can't say I blame him. AJ uh, playing with the crowd there, the people that he was taunting right at the beginning of this match. Graham Hughes is absolutely stunned. What a disgusting show there. Not only the match, but the post-match attack there from AJ Murtor. So much for a clean victory.